Hello everyone. This is my Pentium 166 computer. Also my 386. Works fine but only Windows 3.1 are installed and no software. And remember in the previous video or something other videos I overclocked this computer to 240 megahertz but the problem is the display states show 166 megahertz so I think I just I referred it, referred it back to a 166 megahertz this it is no longer overclocked now turn on the light you can see the computers maybe better so the display are now shows 166 and the computer running now uh, as 166 megahertz. It has a DVD-ROM drive, but I not use it because the computer is too slow to read uh, DVDs. And a floppy drive and also a tape drive that I uh, never used and I don't know even if it works or not. Power button. Reset button and a turbo button. You can see a 166 megahertz. So as you can see on the screen also 166 megahertz. And this computer has still 128 megabytes of RAM installed. And also the hard drive still working, only it is a under hard drive. Uh, keyboard error or no keyboard present. We write back folks. Try this again. Smoke test. I use now a under keyboard because I cannot find the adapter on this moment. I think I we don't now have errors. You can see the hard drive and the DVD drive. Here we go. And this don't have Windows XP Professional anymore because I changed the hard drive to a on the computer that I need. And I never use Windows XP. I no not use XP anymore on this computer because it's so slow too slow. And that was also a previous video you can see that they run XP but it's not so fast. Oh yeah. Oh, whatever. There's also uh, I use this computer not so uh, long ago but a few months ago but still works fine the same wallpaper but I like this wallpaper it can always be changed to a other one Microsoft Windows 98 the Pentium 166 and 128 megabytes of RAM. And the hardware is still the same. The S3 thirds. And this has also the 3D FX Voodoo 1 video card installed. And the Sound Blast 16. No network adapters because I don't use internet on this computer anymore. And it has still has the USB 2.0 USB card. <laughs> what, what, what is that now? Ah, my start menu glitched. Or my mouse is not working right on this moment. The programs. Also software what I installed. 
I think my mouse is not working good. Is this war word? I don't worry. Why is those word? Because the mouse ball was not working. But now the do it this shirt. Microsoft Windows of uh, Windows Microsoft Word Word 2000. Is is Windows ninety eight on a Pentium one sixty six megahertz forty gigabyte hard drive. But I use a jumper to do 32 gigabytes. And we had we had oh yeah, also one 28 megabytes of RAM. And I think this has a 2 megabyte S3 Verge. And a 3D FX do 1 for B of video memory. And that's it, I think. Oh, yeah, and a sound blaster. And we don't save that for now. And let's play a video game. You can see a lot of games, but not all the games are compatible with this computer on this one. Metal Man 2, for example. It is that no, don't even start on this computer because this hard drive was for my older computer. This was a better computer than Pentium 1, but whatever. Let's start Middle Madness 1. And this run runs good. This runs okay, but it's not the fastest in the world. Checkpoint race. And remember, this is a Pentium 166. But loading times is not the fastest in the world. But I'm uh, sure this computer. I'm sure this computer meets the minimum requirements. I believe it is a 133 megahertz. I think I'm not sure, but whatever. And it is not. Uh, it plays okay, but it has uh, stutters here and there. So. Uh, On this part is where this uh, game are very slow. It's game over. 
Let's try again. Thanks, taxi. I'm not recommend this playing this game on a Pentium 166 because it is not the fastest in the world. And, yeah, and a better video card helps the performance, but I don't have a better video card for this right now. And I think uh, you will play this game on a Pentium 2 or a Pentium 3 helps the performance a lot. But I will sh I show you this to the, uh, you can run this game in 3D mode. You can run this on software, but whatever. Now what do you suppose is behind all that? 3D works also. See, even the mouse course cursor are uh, slow. And also Pac-Man. That I play a lot. And that but this works fine, even on a 486 works fine. And maybe even a 386 maybe. That was close. It's also a long time ago where uh, that I played this game. I played this also on a real iGate uh, machine. And I have found this game a few years, years ago. I still like this game, but I don't play it so much. Sometimes I play this game, but not always. Game over. MS Pac-Man. Shut down windows. It's now safe to turn off the computer. We now go to the next one.